girls, uh, even in the schools, they were drinking from the fountains and stuff and didn't know that the water was uh, contaminated. Poison. It's poison. It's poison. Man, I took a bath. I ran some bath water one day, and when I came back, I was like, it's, my water is it's cloudy. I took a bath anyway. After that, my navel and my vagina mm -hmm. had just a bad rash. Then, like I said, I wear a perm in my hair and I color my hair. I've been wearing my hair long, blonde hair for the longest. I could wash my hair because I do hair. Set my hair and it would last two weeks. All of a sudden, my hair is only lasting two or three days, and it's feeling bad. Mm. Again, I'm going, it's got to be the water. So mm. I cut all my hair off and just start. Sometimes we don't have cars to go get water, and we don't have rides to go get water. So water's not being gotten to people that really need it. Thanks, man. something about your hair. Yeah, my hair came out. Uh, I didn't know at the time that I was washing my hair and getting it braided every two months that the water was doing it. So I was washing it constantly, so I ended up with a, a lump on my head that was soft and was throbbing, and I ended up with little bumps around it, so that hair was coming out. So when she washed my hair every time, it would just come out as she was washing it. Why is the water that you turn on in Flint? It's so bad. And there is lead poison here, and it is harmful to you. It is harmful to me for a 76-year-old woman. I'm sure we are thankful for the water that you bring here. I'm very thankful for it. Yes, I cook with it and I drink it. But you gotta heat up four or five gallons of water to take a bath in. Now how is that really helping us? It's not. They're not helping us. Take the money that is coming into Flint. Fix those pipes. That say how, like last summer when they just told us to boil the water, we could drink it. I was doing that. I'm a person that like to take a lot of baths and soap. My skin look like an 80 year old lady's skin up under my clothes. Wow. Because it don't dry it out just that bad where it'll crack open. This, this right here will make a person really flip it's out. frustrating. Yeah. yeah. Every day I'm trying to. I got to make sure the baby don't make a mistake and run and wash her hands because residents making value judgments. Like, am mm -hmm. I gonna bathe with this case, or if I'm cool. gonna if I'm gonna cook? Whole city, but my biggest thing is these babies and these elderly people. That mm -hmm. that's where my heart is at. And you know, if you don't have a health problem, you got one now. Mm -hmm. And if you have a health problem, it's gonna the water's gonna make you worse. You know, and that's really. It's really sad, and it really breaks my heart that they would even do this to this to the city. You know, that's it's really it's really sad.